guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Landon, and we are here again today for they call me <laughs> Crow Tit. <laughs> Just kidding. Pepsi. <laughs> I am five years old, and I cannot get over the fact it's called Crow Tit. But I know it's a bird. It's fine. I'm an immature piece of crap. I get it. It's fine. But this song I have claimed already has been my favorite from HYYH2. Like this one is the one that gets me bumping. I could be like, you know, making a cup of coffee. I could play some Pepsi. I could be in the shower, I could play some Bepze. I could be knitting a sweater and I'm a Bepze. <laughs> It's just, what I'm trying to say is you can always listen to it. So like, feel free to put it on repeat. <laughs> it's okay. But with that being said, no matter how amazing it is, I've heard nothing but great things about A, the choreography, B, the actual dance practice that is apparently iconic, and C, there is another version where they had this like little change up moment for another Love Yourself Tour performance. So what we gonna do today is we're going to be watching the Pepsi On Stage, Live On Stage, Epilogue, Japan Edition 2016. People talking about people People swinging on this song, a lot of motion in the hip area. We're gonna have to check that out for ourselves. Let's go ahead and see. So without any further ado, we're gonna watch the live version first, the dance practice in the middle, and then the bonus clip at the end. I'm ready for this, and I've been waiting too long for this to happen. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Hey, hey. All right, just starting off here, we are in our My Chemical Romance. Welcome to the Black Parade. Looking outfits here, which always gets me riled up because I'm like, yes, sir, let's march into this battle. Listen, I saw the little, yep. Yeah. And I'm loving that already. This is definitely something I'm gonna try to take in as much choreography as I can, but y'all know what I said, that until it's a dance practice, you can't really judge it one hundo, because you never know if it's just the angles or what is um, amplifying a part. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> With that being said, let's keep going now. Doing a lot of this movement where you walk to the stage and then whoa on the end over here and they're doing like the whoa. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like they're being pulled away, like it's being swept, like they're being anchored towards something. A lot of leg stuff, a lot of leg stuff. I'm seeing a lot of leg stuff. Look at Jenny, oh my god. Y'all see all this offbeat dancing? Oh my god, he's like, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like they're literally hitting the oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like they're hitting the uh, ridiculous. This is what makes them stand out and look so intricate and unique when they're dancing. That is it. <laughs> No. Homer Anthony. <laughs> yeah. 
I want more. I want more. We want more. We want more. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. A lot of leg stuff and everything that's attached to the leg. A lot of that stuff too. I'm here. I enjoyed it. I am a fan of this choreo, but let me go ahead and watch this dance practice and we can kind of break it down a little bit more. And I can tell y'all what I specifically love about it besides the leg stuff. <laughs> so much leg stuff. I'm nervous for this because apparently this is going to be crazy. And I was told I need the sub version for this, of this crow tit practice. Like, okay. Uh, oh, yeah, Paper, scissors, rock to determine a member for the dance break. Oh, so it's just changing. Oh. Ho, he said, we're going to film a dance practice video for crow tit. <laughs> Let's have someone take over Ho Suck's part at the end. Okay. <laughs> Yes, I mean, I did it many times, so we said, on broadcasts and our concerts. Could somebody else just do it, please? Like, the dance line is out. The dance line is out. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it crazy how fate works? I don't know. This is my thing too. In my head, I've always considered Tay a part of the dance line too. I know that he's like, I guess not technically. I don't know what y'all think. I mean, Tay to me always got those moves. You know what I'm saying? He could be moving. You saw what he was doing in that run video. I'm just kidding. I don't know, but um, I'm ready. I see, <laughs> I see these outfits already. <laughs> backfired, no plan backfired. Oh. I'm not gonna say it was spoiled because I know there is a scene from this that comes, it's a sugar scene that comes from this. And I've seen it like in a gift form once or twice, you know, but to be honest with you, I never knew like what the deal was, but it's all starting to make sense now, isn't it, boo? Mm, you lost, <laughs> you lost. That's why this went down in history. All right, let's do it. Yeah. Iconic outfits. There were so many levels in the beginning there. There were so many hip thrusts. This is definitely the hip thrust dance. I know it's called Crow Tit, but it should be called hip thrust. Um, listen, dead, dead, dead. That little part where sugar was coming up, I'm like, oh, I don't know if I can survive it. Y'all watching for me though? Y'all making sure I, I get good. Uh, we have our ambulance out here, our EMT. Is that the same thing? I think so, but they're all here. Don't worry, we're good, we're safe. <laughs> Sometimes I just feel like I'm not supposed to be watching. Like they come a little close to the camera and they be doing that kind of stuff. I'm like, oh, my bad, my bad. Did I look in? Wasn't not supposed to see. You know what I mean? <laughs> no, I think honestly, I know that I told y'all already, maybe whenever y'all are seeing this video, that I watched the run dance practice and I had this little moment where I was like, oh, it's not my favorite for the drop kind of thing here. It's a, it's a little simple or something like that or whatever. This, on the other hand, has the simplicity in it, but it has an effect that it just, it rings through. And it's not, it's not just the hip throw. Okay, there's something about this where they're like, boom, 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 boom. Like they walk up and when you hit, hit that foot, you know what I'm saying? When you hit me that foot, <laughs> then the pain is coming off. No, that's what Nikki said, but this is um, oh, great. <laughs> you see, I'm getting choked up here because then we do it, they, 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 they just do things sometimes. Where I'm just like, am I supposed to see this? I love how silly it is. Yeah, yeah. You better get it, Broomy Broom. Shooky Wookie. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey,
they just got like swagger dripping from every single move they do. Hi, my name is Landon and I am now a fan of Jimin in a hat. I didn't know that's something I needed to see, but it is definitely something I will remember forever. Listen, I love just they have that, that sensual coolness about every single move that they do. That makes me jealous that I'm not them. And I think that is the ultimate goal here. Ah. <laughs> Oh, wait, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> he did not just get up there and booty twerk. He did not just get up there and booty twerk, do a couple of things, and then booty twerk again. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just be real? Why was it not longer? Why can we not have a one minute dance break when Suga has lost the game and has to do this? Let me just watch this one more time. Does he have Balenciaga on his butt? No. I'm only twerking like that from now on. Thank you guys so much. Thank you all for coming here. This is the twerk show. <laughs> Let's finish this. Dunga dunga ding dong tape. <laughs> that was so good. Okay, that's, I know that was a fun version. I guess there's no real version of that. Okay, a lot of leg stuff. All right, let's watch one more performance here. We have, this is Bepse from 2018 September, Love Yourself Tour in Hamilton, the fan cam. Now, Emily was telling me that there is something in here that I needed to see. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for, but um, it always seems to find me, so don't worry. Not a <laughs> <laughs> has tickets like this. Who the F has seats right here? How does one obtain seats? I'm getting heated. How are there seats so close to the stage? I have I have only ever seen a concert in the nosebleed sections, okay? Like I can't fathom what's it like to not watch it from a screen, okay? There was a tweet I saw that said, I'm afraid of the BTS stands that have never been to a concert before. Like how are they so strong? Like what are they capable of? And I'm like, honestly, when you show me stuff like this, I'm capable of stealing a ticket from a child. No, 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 no. I would never do that. But I will do something. I'm gonna sneak in. No, no. Stop. Don't say it on the camera. I'm glad that you dumb bitch. Give away your plan. No, I'm just kidding. But like, honestly, I'm just angry. I just want to be right here. <laughs> Especially if the room was there and now Hobie walking up to me. I'm just like, hey, sir, what's up? No, absolutely not. I mean, I know he's talking to the camera, but that's me. Oh, it's a breaking moment. I can feel it. Thank you, save me. I don't... I think for the first time in my career, I'm speechless. In my entirety of 200 videos. <laughs> and I was just demanding that I be in that spot. <laughs> you know what? The Lord looked at me and said, you wouldn't have survived. You would not have survived, young Skywalker. I'm, um, sorry. <laughs> That was petty. That was the most amazing petty thing that we're going to watch again. Like, I thought this was it. I was like, he's getting it. Look at this. Oh, 
I quit. I quit the fandom. Thank you all so much for this journey. <laughs> that is the conclusion that I needed. That is the conclusion. <laughs> if the roadmap stops right now, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you could hear the audience. Like, you thought they were screaming the loudest they could, but you could hear the audience get even louder. One more, I mean, just one more time just to hear the audience. Like, only for no other reason. Just to hear the audience. Really listen to it, guys. Pay attention to nothing else but the sound. <laughs> Like it goes through the roof. <laughs> sorry if you cut you off, room. Like, you did great, sweetie, but how are you supposed to follow that up? You can't. I'm sorry. That's the rules, okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, the song should have been called Attack of Bepse, because you know what? I feel attacked. I feel personally attacked right now in this very second. We could have just been great watching the regular versions of those. You know, didn't have to see any of these special behind the scenes, <laughs> because now it's like, how do I go to a concert? <laughs> how do I build an arena for them specifically myself and my yard? Oh, just kidding. I live in a complex. So unless they can fit an arena and a two by six parking spot, <laughs> that's nothing I can do. But just to want to watch that more and more and more and more and more and more. <laughs> okay. okay, thank y'all for that addition. I appreciate that suggestion. That was definitely well worth the other watch. <laughs> With that being said, I'm going. I've done too much today. Y'all got me gone. I'm gone. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like it, make sure you click like down below. Comment what is your favorite part, but I mean, obviously... <laughs> What else are you gonna put? Um, subscribe to the channel. If you would like to see me reacting to this without anything cut out of the songs, you can go ahead and follow me on Patreon where I post all the unedited reactions. And um, I've gotta go marinate in this. Like I gotta go simmer for at least 10 to 12 hours in a crock pot, bitch. Like this is something that will be soaked into my long-term memory and I don't plan on it going anywhere soon. So thank y'all for that. Uh, one more spot, take it up. <laughs> I love y'all. I would love to know them by name. So